my business idea came from um, a moment when I was painting a bedroom for a friend's son. Um, he wanted a mural for his wall and it was kind of my light bulb moment of this is what I really want to do. Um, and then I realized it was a great opportunity to combine my art background and my design background. I started my own business because I just really loved painting. Um, and so many opportunities started to pop up that I kind of just jumped into the business world without even thinking about it. And now I'm just kind of learning all the fun back end of it. So what makes my business unique is that rather than spray cans, I use paint and a paintbrush. And then I also create one of a kind custom uh, design that as a commercial artist, my style is flexible. And I, that way I can create the exact look that you are looking for, whether you are a homeowner or a business. So the impact I really want to make in my community is I really want to bring joy and life into communities and have um, a reason that people kind of smile. I'm currently working on a Walkerville Alley project right now where um, we're hoping to kind of clean things up and have paint on garages and fences so that way it kind of feels like a safe, happy place to walk down instead of a scary place. I think charging what I'm worth. That's the hardest part. Um, as a creative, it's hard to figure out pricing, asking people uh, for how much it actually is, because art can be subjective, so some people just don't understand the cost of it. So the mantra I live by is uh, a Gary Vee quote, and it's kindness over everything. Um, I think kindness can be seen as a weakness, but I think it's actually a huge strength and I really want to put more kindness and empathy out in the world and I'm hoping that can be kind of like the main level of where my business starts and then move forward from there. Oh yeah, 100%, I would love to mentor women. Um, I actually really want to, one day once I, I feel like I know enough, I want to help other creatives go into business and, and learn that business side because we're not taught it as creatives. People just think we're going to be starving artists um, and I really want to help elevate, improve, and show that you can do it as a creative. So the stigma of being um, an artist and not successful or making money is very, very frustrating. Um, and it's unfortunate because I think it's just a, a funny thing that we started saying as the time has gone on. And it's almost small talk for some people. They just assume that like you don't make money with your art. But I know so many artists that are making even up to like six figures doing it, making it as an artist. And people forget that we consume art 24 seven. Like the furniture that we sit in, the posters and signs that we see, literally everything around us is art. And I just, hopefully I can kind of bring awareness to that, like how important artist is, but you can make it as, an, as a creative and you can make money with it.